On Thursday, July 30th, 2020, the Ministry of Health and Wellness reported its 25th case of COVID-19. Presently, the individual is in the intensive care unit at the Respiratory Hospital for Management and Care. The clinical team reports that he is stable and responding well to care. The team continues investigations and contact tracing to establish the source and contain transmission. Four caretakers and close relatives have been swabbed and placed in quarantine. Three healthcare workers and 14 patients have been tested and placed in quarantine due to possible exposure. This gentleman received many visits by family and friends during his recuperation at home. Investigations continue into a possible contact if a travel history at this time. We await test results before any links are confirmed and communicated. On Thursday, July 9, 2020, St. Lucia received the first international flight since the border closure in March 2020. In an effort to safely facilitate the return of our nationals, quarantine centers have been set up using various hotels. This has proven to be an important measure in containing COVID-19 on island, and failure to adhere can have serious implications for disease containment. Over the last few months, many persons who've been granted home quarantine have not been adhering to those protocols established. All persons on home quarantine are required to stay indoors for 14 days. The public is asked to cooperate and encourage family members and friends who have returned from overseas and are presently in quarantine to remain at home for the 14-day duration. Failure to adhere can lead to community spread of COVID-19 at this time. The names of all persons in home quarantine are forwarded to the Royal St. Lucia Police Force to assist with compliance. The public is advised to alert the nearest police station or the Ministry of Health and Wellness at 468-5318-468-5349 with information in relation to anyone who breaches home quarantine guidelines. Further updates will be provided as information becomes available.